Chinese regime is a repressive, authoritarian uh, regime, uh, a country with very few democratic rights. Um, I was struck by the decision to close all of the Phoenix Park to access to any public to facilitate this meeting. Um, not just to facilitate the meeting, presumably, because you could have had lots of people in the Phoenix Park and the meeting could have gone ahead, but to facilitate the meeting happening without expressions of protest about what is happening in China. Was that a request of the Chinese administration that that happened, or how did that uh, occur? Um, secondly, I'd like to ask what was the response of the Premier to the points you raised in terms of repression within China. In particular, I want to raise the situation of the Uyghur people. Uh, at the height of the repression of Uyghur people, a denial of uh, culture, a denial and discrimination against language, a definite denial of any question of self-determination, there were maybe up to a million Uyghur people in uh, prison, in, in some form of, of detention, without any uh, trial. But, but the repression does seem to continue. I mean, there was a report just last year of the uh, Office of the High Commissioner of uh, Human Rights of the UN, which concluded that since 2017, the Chinese government had committed grave rights violations against millions of Uyghurs and other Turkic people in Xinjiang. Abuses so systematic and widespread that they, quote, may constitute international crimes, in particular crimes against humanity. Did you put points like that to the Premier and what was the response? Decisions made on security matters, road closures, closures of the Phoenix Park for example, um, they're not made by me, they're security matters um, and are dealt with by the Guardian and the Defence Forces and of course uh, remain confidential. Uh, in relation to Xinjiang and the Uyghur population, uh, I did raise our concerns about um, their treatment. Um, Premier Li disputed the veracity of uh, those concerns um, and invited me to uh, visit the region myself to see with my own eyes um, uh, what the situation is. Um, I urge China to implement the recommendations of the recent UN report on the situation and to engage proactively with the UN High Commissioner for Human Rights, Michelle Bachelet.